What's up, what's up, what's up, everybody? Welcome back to my channel. I'm definitely not bragging. This is nothing to brag about. It's just a couple things that I purchased, um, and I want to share them with you here on my channel. So if you're interested, please stay tuned, and I'll get that right out to you. So if you're still here, it's mainly because I'm sure you want to see exactly what I got in my haul. First off, before I show you anything, I just want to say thank you so much for stopping by my channel. Um, if you have subscribed, thank you so much. You don't know how much you mean to me. If you haven't subscribed yet, please go ahead on and make that red subscribe button gray. Um, you'll be glad you did. Hopefully, you'll be glad you did. If you want to keep up with me when I'm not here on YouTube, you can most certainly reach out to me on any of my other social media platforms via Twitter, Instagram, Periscope, um, and Pinterest. That's all at BusyB. It'll be right here. So, if you want to um, hit me up there, Feel free to hit me up there if you're on Facebook. It's Byron Shears. And yeah, I love to see you. So the first thing, I ordered some lashes. I follow, um, it's a, her name is Platinum D here on YouTube. I really thoroughly enjoy her videos. Um, she's a bomb makeup artist in Dallas, Texas. So you guys should check her out. I'll see if I can figure out a way to leave a link in the description box down below. But she was talking about these lashes um, and I have them right here. These lashes, they're from eBay. I'm gonna say, yeah, from eBay. And I got these lashes. She talked about them in her haul, so I can't wait to try these. These typically aren't a lash that I would try on myself. I mean, they're pretty, can you see them? It's so bright. They're pretty, they're pretty big, but whatever. I figured I should try them. They were only $2 a pack, so. I got a couple packs of these. Um, I've given some of them out, and so I have two left. Um, what else did I get? Oh, Melanie Mills. I got the Melanie Mills set. This is the Hollywood Gleam on the Glow set. So inside there's three different colors. There's rose gold, bronze gold, and deep gold. And I did use um, one of them in a tutorial here on my channel. I'll link that down below. Um, it was my summer glow up, my summer glow up tutorial. But I really like the product and I didn't get a chance to really talk about the product. Um, it's thicker than I thought it was, but I like that. I, I like the consistency of it. I mean, because at the end of the day, I wouldn't want something running like on my skin. But you can use it on face and body and I really did enjoy it thoroughly. The little bottles. I like this and this is the um, the trial kit so I felt like why not go with the trial kit so that way I could get um, all three colors and um, thus far I've used deep golden I haven't used the rose gold or the bronze gold yet so be on the lookout for that I'm sure maybe in the future I will be um, doing a look with that Oh, and I also got um, a Wet n Wild blending brush. It's like pink. Can you see it? Yep. It's like pink and white. I don't know. I didn't get it really for the color. I got it merely because it was a dollar at Walgreens. I feel like you can never have too many blending brushes. So, yeah. I picked up another blending brush. Um, also, at that Walgreens, I stopped by... Iman Cosmetics and I got this Afterglow Bronzer. It seems to be really, really pretty. Can you see it? It has three different shades in it, three different tones and it also comes with like a little a little Iman um, powder puff. 
So I haven't tried it yet. I can't wait to try it. I've heard other good things about it from other artists that I really do look up to. So I figured I'd pick that up while I was in there. I also went to NYX. NYX opened up a store here um, in Florida recently. Very recently, actually. Um, and so I got a chance to go to the grand opening and I picked up a few items. I picked up an orange color corrector. I also watched, there's a YouTuber, um, Star Milan, here on on YouTube. He has really nice videos as well, but he constantly uses this orange corrector and I've never been able to find this orange corrector. Every time I go to look for this orange corrector, they're always sold out. So I figured with him using it, so many other people loving it, it must be good. And so I definitely want to try it. I have yet to even open the thing. It's still, I, I haven't even tried it yet, but um, I like how it's a light salmon color opposed to the LA Girl orange concealer is more of like a really deep orange and um, I'm like a nice like a brown bone so I, that deep orange I can't really use that deep orange it's much too dark but this one looks like it's gonna work just fine so I'll keep you guys posted on that I also picked up two glitters from NYX Cosmetics you can't really see it because of my setup but I picked up a blue and I picked up like a gunmetal glitter I don't know why I've been feeling blue lately, but I've really, as you can see, like, I've really been feeling blue lately. So, I picked up some blue glitter and, um, the gunmetal glitter from NYX. And I also picked up the Cosmic Metals Lip Cream in a blue tone. It's so pretty. I don't know the name of it, though. Oh, Dark Nebula? Nebula, dark nebula, I guess. And I got a pencil to match. It's an eye pencil, but a pencil is a pencil. So if you like me, you'll put it wherever. Um, it's just like a little blue pencil to match the blue lip perfectly. And um, yeah, I was feeling it. I didn't get a chance to get my hands on um, Kylie Jenner. She made like a nice blue lipstick. I don't know the name of it, but it was like a blue metallic. If you know the name of the Kylie Jenner lipstick, leave it in the comment box down below. I can't really remember the name. I can't really think of the name, but I felt like this was um, a nice close, from the pictures anyway, like I said, I don't have it. So from the pictures, it looks like it's a really nice tone. So it's just a blue metallic lip. I also picked up, that's it from NYX. I also picked up um, from a local store here, it's a purple eyeliner. I haven't opened it yet. So it's just a purple eyeliner pencil that I got from LA Girl. And um, so yeah. Sephora, Sephora, Sephora. So I stopped by Sephora and picked up a few things. Um, so I had tried the Precisely My Brow Pencil and I loved it so much that I wanted to go back and get another color. So I got a number six in this pencil. This pencil is like mad bomb, mad precise, perfect name, absolutely love it. And um, if you have sparse brows, you might wanna run and go, go get that. Go get that, because prior to, I was all about Anastasia Beverly Hills, which I still love Anastasia Beverly Hills. I love the dip brow, and I love some of her other brow products. Um, I've also heard that Damone Roberts has like bomb brow products as well, but I'm loving this right now, so yeah. Um, I also picked up a Dare Real Mascara in Brown. Um, I wanted to create like a look, like a brown type look so in the near future you might see it but yeah so their real mascara in brown and i absolutely love the formula of their real mascara i wear the black one all the time i actually have it on today and i'm hoping that the formulation is the same just the color is totally different i'm not sure but we'll see we'll see 
Um, what else did I get? Oh, masks. I got the face mask, the rose face mask, mask. The rose face mask in ultra, it's ultra moisturizing and brightening. And I also got the orchid eye mask, anti-aging and smoothing for under the eye. So I picked these up. I think you can never go wrong with these, I think. Um, I've heard really good things about them. I wore one the other day, and I really did like um, the After Effects of it. So, I don't know. I'm thinking that they might be on to something with those face masks. Also, I picked up um, a bronzer from Makeup Forever. So, this is a bronze fusion. Just a deep um, bronzer in 30M. From Makeup Forever, it's just a bronzer, nothing spectacular, but I've heard, I've heard good things of this bronzer, so you never know. I might do something. We'll see. Might do something for me. And I also got a Smashbox lip gloss in cognac. That's the color that I'm wearing right now. This is my ultimate all-time favorite lip gloss i love this color so much it's like a nice brown with like gold flecks in it but the the flecks of gold is so finely milled like the glitter is so finely milled you really don't even see it on the lip like at all because prior to me putting on my lips i was a bit scared of it but i absolutely absolutely love it like i have to have it like so much so i have it literally sitting like right here by me like I love it. Like, it's so bomb. Last thing I got from Sephora is a single eyeshadow. Um, this eyeshadow is limited edition. And the color is called Stud. So, this is from their Hard Wired eyeshadow collection. And um, I think I might get one or two more. I wasn't impressed with all of the colors. However, this particular color gave me absolute light. Isn't this cute? It's so cute. Like, and I love black and white. So, um, But yeah, this color is like... Oh, let me see. This color is everything. Let me see. I'll swatch it. I don't want to stick my hands in it. Like, Look at my finger. Wait, can you see it? Just... Get into that. Now look at it on my hand. Uh, yeah, it's like ashy. Oh, it's like this cool tone, gray, sparkly. I don't know. I don't know how to describe it, but it's absolutely gorgeous, and I absolutely love it. So. That was my little eyeshadow that I got from NARS. And I do believe that was everything that I got from Sephora. So, yeah, everything that I got from Sephora. I got Kills. So, this is a brand that I just recently got turned on to. Um, I don't have much stuff from Kills, honestly. Um, I went into the store and what did I buy? I think I bought like a serum or something like that. And um, I bought a small one, whatever it was, it was the trial size. It wasn't like a big one, it was like a travel size. And so the lady gave me a whole bunch of samples and in that sample, she gave me a sample of the shave cream. Now I tend to cut my own hair, so I shave myself and I use razors and I had a shaving cream that I tried from them and the shaving cream was bomb. So I went back in to get that particular shaving cream and they came out with a new formula. Well, a, a different formula. So, because they still had the same one that um, I actually went in for, but she told me to try this one. So um, with the receipt, I think you can bring everything back within a certain amount of days or whatever. I'm sure it'll be just as good. It's a smooth glider. So it's Kale's Close Shavers um, Squadron. 
squash oil, whatever, I don't know, but it looks like this, and um, I'm excited, I'm glad I got it, um, I know it's supposed to, like, has, it has coconut in it, and aloe vera, and it's soothing, and it smells amazing, and I cannot wait to use it, so, I grabbed this, um, in the smaller size, just because I wanted to try it first before I actually committed to the product, but, yeah, I'm excited, can't wait to try it, and I also got some facial fuel, inner, um, energizing face wash, which I've never tried either, so, I got this, like, in a smaller, um, in a smaller, I heard a little bit about Kale's, so I figured out I would try them out. And um, I signed up for their email, um, where I guess they give like discounts um, via email and just keep you up to par. You know, the same old, same old. And so I got a free lip balm, which was cool. And I got an admit. So, yeah. And um, that's it. <laughs> that's my entire haul. I told you it was a small haul. It's just a mini haul, nothing major. Um, but these are just some products that I got. Some I've tried before and I absolutely love them. Some I have not tried yet. So if you see me using them in future videos, that means I love them. If you don't see me using them in future, in future videos, more than likely I didn't care for that product or that product didn't necessarily work for me. So. Thank you all so much for indulging me. If you made it this far to the video, that means you enjoyed this video. If you want, um, you can go out and get some of these products yourself. I'll link as many products as I possibly can find um, in the description box down below. Thank you so much for liking this video, giving me a thumbs up. If you enjoyed this video, if you like these type of videos, um, of course, I'm always welcoming great positive feedback you can leave that in the comment section down below and if you're not a subscriber i hope maybe this video would make you want to become a part of the beehive family right here on my channel turn that red subscribe button to gray remember all subscriptions here are free so you don't have to pay for them i do all the work i just ask that you enjoy the finished product and my lovelies, until next time, as I always say, love and light, be beautiful. Later.